shares with us.
Hey, what do you got for me? A tablet I found, dropped by one of our people. Do you think you can fix it? Ouch. Wish I could say yes. But what this tablet needs is a prayer, not a scientist. You said it belongs to someone in the Resistance? Yeah. Human, based on the boot prints I found nearby, and female, judging from the audio recording I snagged from it. They made a point to record in privacy, away from HQ. A human female. Well, that narrows it down. <laughs> Good luck. You were right about Talon. I'm glad I listened. <gasps> Have you been out in the rainforest recently, Nalin? Yes, actually. I was at a field lab earlier. Just got back to HQ. Did you drop anything on the way back? Gear or tech, perhaps? Oh, no. I travel very light. The field lab has everything I need. Fewer things on me means fewer chances to be forgetful. So, no time to record poetry, I guess. Time for poetry? Never mind. Have you seen Danny anywhere? At the field lab. She stayed behind with some of the others. Any idea who might own that broken tablet? They went out to record alone. So someone bold and proud, maybe too proud for their own good, if they value privacy over personal safety. I wonder what kind of leader I will be. I have to find my own path now. Here you go. Have a look. You take care of yourself. They're acting like Pandora has endless resources. I mean, they're prop. Choose with care. Be safe. Hey, Priya, have you been out in the rainforest recently? I wish. I have way too much work here. So, no chance you might have dropped something out there? <laughs> Only way that'd happen is if I knocked something off my desk and it slid all the way out through the entrance to HQ. Anka, have you been out in the rainforest recently? Well, yeah. I'm a pilot. I go out all the time. Gotta keep an eye on those RDA patrols, you know? Any chance you dropped a piece of gear or tech the last time you went out? What? No way. The only way I could do that is if I'm literally dropping a tablet from the cockpit or something. I can, but it's not a pretty scene. Instead of all this green, it's gray and brown as far as the eye can see. Don't remind me. I wouldn't trade Pandora for anything.
Turns out the log I brought for Jin had something living in it. Something creepy and crawly with lots and lots of legs. You gotta screen everything twice around here. Not about to forget that anytime soon. No I think this tablet belongs to you. No, sorry. Mine's tucked away safely in my locker. Sealed. We were so close to losing everything. Thankfully, Pandora will heal. Why did you say tablet when I mentioned missing gear? Just the first thing that popped in my Were you thinking of this tablet? Where in the hell did you get that? An Aranahe gatherer pointed me to where you dropped it. What... What did you find on it? I recovered some audio. Shit. We do not talk about this here. Follow me. Still feeling that flight. Anka's. It's embarrassing. I went to that spot specifically so no one would have to be subjected to my nonsense. How much did you hear, anyway? All of it. I, I won't tell anyone. Oh, all of it. That's great. I know the wasps didn't take too kindly to my poem. Ugh, why did I go to that spot in the first place? Real rookie business. What was I thinking? I guess you were thinking about love. I'm not exactly the best when it comes to talking about these feelings or whatever. Just really wanted a place away from all the noise to digest all this. You know the saying, love makes dumbass people do dumbass things, right? A good nothing, that all did. Even without the RDA and these fun, tense times we live in, do you know how hard it is to try to be romantic here? I can't pick flowers without half of them trying to kill me. Maybe I can help. No, look, I appreciate the gesture and all, but let's not. I tried to get all mushy and ended up kicking the hornet's nest. Or a literal wasp's nest. Hive. Same thing. So forget it. I'll move on. I'm good at this sort of thing. 